Hey there guys, what's up? It's a new episode of Pokemon Black. Okay, so today we're going to continue Drift File City, so why not let's continue to Drift File City actually. And who do you have here? Cheer and some guy. Um, so you're the trainer Elisa was talking about, eh? I'm Clay. Oh, I'm the gym leader around these parts. Don't be expecting no welcome now, cause when we lower the bridge, that the plasm guys would cut don't escape all in the rocks. What a brother. We're grateful that you lowered the bridge, but how is it our fault that they escaped? You can say whatever you want, but what's important is you all showed up and then Team Plasma escaped. Maybe it's a little heavy handed, but you are. What the hell is it? You are gonna start looking for Team Plasma too. Yeah, both Talent and Tainus, aren't ya? Yes, we are. Tell you what. If you found Team Plasma, I let you challenge my gym. Life's all about give and take. Well, I suppose that's a fair. But really, we would have looked for Team Plasma if we had, if he hadn't asked. I can get stronger while beating that brother from Birch. Sparrow, I'll go on ahead. Yeah, but you'll be late, like always. <laughs> okay, so here we are at Drift File City, the actual city. So let's actually first go to the Pokemon Center. Okay, so far you look, but actually, if you go talk to this lady right here, you can get three repeat balls. Basically, it's a um, it lets you catch a Pokemon you already have. It lets you catch it easier. But first, let's actually if you go on your left right here, sorry, and go up here. I found an Ultra Ball. And now back in the first city. If you go in this house. Grass Nut. Hmm. No, sorry, I didn't have it. But if you uh, have a Pokemon with Grass Knot uh, or any other move with that, you can get a free Heart Scale. Which I'll basically explain later what that does. And um, who do you have here? I'm a Heartbreaker. Dot, dot, dot. My name is dot, 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 Charles. I wanted to get the attention of all of a girl I like, so I learned a new style of Pokemon Battle. It's named Rotation Battle. Want to learn about it? Yeah, why not? In rotation battles, you send out three Pokemon at a time and battle. One Pokemon takes the lead position and the other two stand on each side. The trick is, each turn you can change their positions. And that's a rough explanation of rotation battles. I'm a heartbreaker. My name is Charles. Hey, if you're a trainer, how about a rotation battle? Yes, why not? Why not? You've got a good attitude, don't you? I'm a heartbreaker. My name is Charles. I'm always at full throttle. Okay then, so here we are at a rotation battle. Now, if you um, if you you play Pokemon Black just like me now, you're going to have another, or you're going to have the same thing, a rotation battle. But if you play Pokemon White, you're going to have a triple battle, which is basically three Pokemon at the same time, no rotations, just three against three. I think I need to switch out actually. So here you can see on the bottom. If you go to the right, you can have your left actually, which is now crush. And I think I will go with him. Let's go for the aqua jet. And dang it. That's not going to do much. And my emulator is again slowing down. I'm not sure what it is about. Sorry for this. 
I'm truly am sorry. But now let's actually go and see Bob. And yes, he doesn't switch out. Very nice. So oh, crap, he does. Okay, what you gonna do? Ooh, look at that. It did decent damage, actually. I'm just going to stay out with peace, I guess, and let the... No, not peace! Why the hell peace? Why the hell bite, I mean? But hey, what, what are you gonna say? And I'll just keep it. And crush is level 29, very nice. Gaining levels. Oh, no, not bites. Ah, oh, what? Ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> crush, okay then. Oh man, this is annoying that slow. I am truly sorry for this. Maybe it is my uh, my Camtasia Studio which uh, slows down uh, this move. But hey, what you gonna do? Maybe it's also because it's a rotation battle, actually. Because yeah, it's pretty heavily for uh, emulator, actually. Just a rotation battle. Okay, if I'm gonna ask, Peace is also 29. Wow! Sorceress level 30! Very nice! Still, yeah, attention. Sorry for the sound. That was a truck. You have to understand, your Pokemon to win a rotation battle, if you want to have more rotation, go to Uplucid City! Which is the final city, actually. And also, when you, you can find here a secret entrance, which will lead you to this, a big pearl. Very nice. Not just a pearl, but a big pearl. You can sell this for a big bunch of money. And actually, when you go in, here you have the Drift Fail Market. And actually, when you... Somewhere around here... I'm sure there was an item right here. Okay, this is very strange. Very ha okay, I'm going to put my dungeon machine. Oh, it was right here. Okay. Here's a heart scale, actually. So now we have two already. Very nice. And if you talk to this lady, you can get Moo Moo Milk. Damn it. I only bought one. <laughs> But you can buy a dozen, which is very nice because there was 12 bottles, now we have 13 and I, uh, yeah, they're just like soda pops and like lemonades, they give a lot of HP for the price they, uh, you have to pay. Now I have 25, that's more than enough. And when you talk to this guy, he will give you something. If you have level 30 Pokemon or more, which is an expert belt. It, after the power of the of its moves is slightly boosted when they are super effective. Very nice. That is nice, I guess. But wait a second, let me When you talk to this guy. Okay, apparently nothing. Wait a second. Oh yeah, if you have uh, 50 or more uh, Pokemon scene, which you should have, you can get a Shell Bell, which uh, boosts your HP by a little bit each turn, which is nice, I guess. And when you go in here, and talk to this person. You can learn some moves, but only on your starter Pokemon, and uh, I'm, I wouldn't recommend the moves. They're not that great. And in this house, there is nothing. Okay, sorry about that. But now let's actually explore the city a bit more. Let's go down. 
Here we are at the cold storage. Actually, there's a new area with some trainers, so let's actually switch on because socialists have a kill me, so yeah. yeah. Why not let's bake in a big front? Actually, in this area, you can catch a new Pokemon, which is an ice type, Vanillet. It's actually a pretty good ice type, in my opinion. And it's the uh, first time ever you can get a ice type in the, in the beginning of the game. I mean, beginning, not that much beginning, but yeah, you can get a lot of ice types mostly at the end of the game. And now we can already get one after the fourth gym, which is pretty nice. And we're poisoned. Dang it. I hate poison. Carablast. Uh, I think I'm gonna stick with this. It is a bug and flying type. We haven't seen them before. So yeah, flame charge will do the job. Look at that. One hit to kill. Uh. And here we have another youngster. My dad is working in a gym. I'm receiving special training here. Interesting. Youngster Albert. With his Joltik, which is an electric and bug type. Interesting type, if you ask me. That's a pretty cool Pokemon, in my opinion. It's a very speedy electric type, so. Yeah, if you haven't an electric type or a book type, you get this one! <laughs> Not that book, book types are that much necessary in each game, I shall say. Here we have Dwebble again, that's a, a long time we've seen that. Let's flame charge it and see what damage we do. Pretty nice damage, I guess. Smackdown, that's not gonna hurt. But poison. But why not let's flame charge it again and finish the Dwebble off. Yeah. Bye bye, Dwebble. Very nice, level 30. So let's switch out again, actually. And I'm not going to pick my bag just because. Then the beautiful music is gone. For a few notes, send it to the Pokemon Farm for a you send it by ship. Use the best method for your needs. Interesting. Uh, what do you have here? You can have a rocky helmet, which uh, every time your opponent hits you by a physical move, uh, your opponent gets hit by an uh, attack, I will say. Do you battle? No? Ah, that's a shame. And in the trunk, you can find a PP up, which is nice. Now well, let's. Um yeah, here's Shimon, mystically appeared. Oh, mysteriously. And of course he's late like I just told, but I'm going to spray a repel right here because I don't want to run into any Pokemon. So let's spray a super repel. Come on, where is it? So oh, right here. Okay. Here you can get a hard scale, so uh, that's the second one already in this town. And uh, when you answer, if you can show the Pokemon with a special move, you can have a third one, which is nice. Here we have an item, an eater. Interesting. And this dude, which is a trainer. The pure chill of the cold storage. Taste how cold it is. I don't want it to taste cold, actually. <laughs> But hey, who cares? It is a battle worker, Eddie. It is Pensage. 
Okay, I can get <laughs> Peace versus Passage. Simi Sage versus Passage. Pretty nice. Well, I guess I'm going to go for the bite. That will be the most effective here. <laughs> he does the same. But of course, our Peace or our Simi Sage is much better. And he said he has a timber. Well, why not? Let's just stay in. And scene bomb the thing. Chili? I feel the shiver. Interesting. And here you can have a protein, which is nice, it's bo it boosts your sp your attack, but I'm going to save that for my last Pokemon, because that is a real beast in attack, so yeah, maybe you know already who it is, but hey, it's not that long anymore. Now let's actually go into the cold storage. Um. Well, that that still, is there anything more important than strength for trainers like the champion said? Oh, I'll never understand. Just by thinking about it. What about her? Let's hurry up and check the inside. Yeah. When you walk through the containers, some places are frozen, so you go sliding around. Yay. You can get an item, which is a netball. It does something, but I cannot remember. So, hey. Actually, when you go here... Um, I thought, wasn't there an item? Uh, yeah, there was an item. Okay, how do I get so oh, yeah, right. Like, you go here, bump to the right, left, no right, I mean, and then up, and then down. You can have Scald, which is a very good TM for a water type Pokemon, which we have, and I think I'm going to teach it, actually. Let me just see where the hell it is. Scald. Look at that. 80 power. It's a special. I know, I know. Crush is a physical attacker. But, um, we'll see. Um, ancient power isn't really physical, so I think I'm getting rid of ancient power. It's not that useful. So, yeah. And Scald will be removed also later, but hey, I just need a better water attack than uh, Aqua Jet, actually. When it's cold, we're a lot of clothes. Only humans could come up with everything so clever. Yeah. No way, man. Did you... Wow. Did we invent it, clothes? Wow. Wow. Very yeah. Impressive. Impressive. Okay. <laughs> now let's actually uh, switch out, I guess, and go to Crush. Because yeah, he's the best against these Pokemon. Flame burst. Okay, let's actually test our new Scald. Now, why the hell is it that low on accuracy? I haven't used it. How is that even possible? Yeah, what you gonna do? Okay, a little experience. Timber. Um, well, I guess I'm going to switch back out to peace. Peace, my man. Timber, let's go for the seed bump. Oh, look at that damage. One hit KO, of course. Kill the worker, Victor. Um, wasn't there something down here? No, I guess. Oh, no. I remember already. No. What are you? What are you doing here? Let's warm up with a Pokemon Bell. Okay then. Why not? Worker Glenn. With his pet boar. That's a good job for peace. Obviously. <laughs> Seed bomb it. Look at that damage. And a timber! Again, let's just seed bump it and he will die. 
Just like all the others before him. Sorry for the slow down there. But here you have a mini puzzle, which is pretty easy actually. And hey, we're pretty high right now. What are you doing here? Although I'm in the castle, my heart is burning. Interesting. Very, very interesting. And he has a girder. First time we see this one, it is the I think then. Um, it is the evolution of timber. A fighting type. Yep, it's a pretty good one in my opinion. Um, dang, I think I'm gonna... No! Luckily I don't die. Let's finish him off then with a sea bump! Bye bye, girder! And we grew to level 30! Very nice, love, very nice, very, very nice. Worker Philippe. First, let's actually switch back. No, not to that. No, dang it! And it's raining. Ah, of course, it always has to be something while I'm recording. Well, come on, what do you want to say, my brand, my man? The best trainer of ice type Pokemon in the Cold Switch? That's me! That's a you! Who do you have then? Rocker Patton. Hey, look at that! It's a Vanuit, the ice cream Pokemon. It's a very nice looking Pokemon. Uh, a lot of um, people who I know said, Ugh, such a sucky Pokemon. It looks dumb. It looks ridiculous. Well, I, I actually think it looks pretty cool, actually. It's a pretty good Pokemon, also, so yeah. Timber, that's not a nice type. <laughs> I thought you said. You're the best ice trainer, but you don't have a full ice team. <laughs> but hey, why not? Let's go for the I Aqua Jet now. Rock throw, not gonna do that much. Let's go for the Scald. Rock throw, that's not gonna do that much. Let's see how much Scald does. Look at that. We defeated the best ice type trainer. Okay, here we have an ice seal. If your Pokemon may be frozen, but let's go up here and talk to this dude. <laughs> Battle. Okay, apparently he's very cold. Worker Ryan, Timber. If he haven't seen enough of you. Let's see how many times are we going to have to see that guy. Bye, it's okay then. Bye bye. <laughs> uh, we'll kill him. Let's finish him off with an aqua jet. Okay, he's storing energy. We go for the aqua jet. And bye bye, Timber. Almost level 30. 30. 30. Timber, let's go for the Scald again. Octro, not going to do that much. And, oh, burned. Very nice. Uh, let's finish him off with an Aqua Jet. Bam! Bye bye, Timber! And Vanillet, okay, I guess we can finish you also. Why is the ice cream truck going now? It's raining, it's in the evening. Seriously now. But hey, I think we're, we're going to end the episode already pretty soon, so yeah. I'm sh shivering. Yeah, you are. And ooh, there was an item. Hey, Hyper Potion, okay, very nice item. And it's cheering again. What are you doing here? Oh, is someone in there? Yes, I guess. Shall we go then? 
well, next time we will find out, find out, uh, who the hell is in this container, or maybe it is Team Plasma, maybe it is somebody else, or something else. We'll see all that in the next episode, when we'll take on this container, with this mysterious people or monster in it, who knows. And also, we'll be taking on the gym leader and gym. See you guys all next time in the next episode of Pokemon Black. Later.